This video is about an Irish beer that created an Irish cultural icon called Sally O'Brien. And it's not the Irish beer you might be thinking of. Harp Lager was first produced in 1960 as a bottled beer by Guinness in response to the trend among drinkers in Ireland and Britain towards continental lager. The brand was marketed with the Brian Baru Harp as its emblem and used slogans such as Harp, stay sharp to the bottom of the glass. This advert was first shown on Irish TV in 1980 and it caused a sensation. There were two lines that were constantly quoted from it. One was, And Sally O'Brien and the way she might look at you. Followed by, you could fry an egg on the stones here, if you had an egg. So, without further ado, roll it there, Colette. What I miss about home is the rain and the greenness and the pint of harp. And the evening before us and friends coming in and the pint of harp and Sally O'Brien and the way she might look at you and joining the chorus and the pint of her oh, the money is good and the suntan is free you could fry an egg on the stones here if you had an egg and you could certainly sink a pint of harp if you had a pint of harp Sally O'Brien was in fact played by an English actress called Vicky Michelle she became an instant hit with hot-blooded Irishmen and almost 30 years after the advert, she gave the following interview. Quote, I flew over and did the ad. Then two years later, I got a call from my agent asking if I had any Irish blood. Apparently, Charles Hawhey had been giving out that Sally O'Brien wasn't Irish. But my granny was from Cork, so luckily I do have a genuine Irish connection. With her Irish credentials sorted, Vicky embarked on a tour of Ireland's best pubs at the height of her harp fame. Quote, I had no idea that the ad had taken off and was shocked. Men were cheering, Sally, Sally, it was incredible. I remember thinking at the time, even if I never became famous, at least I have the experienced fame in Ireland. As to describe Sally's sultry stare, Vicky says, it's all about understated sexiness. Vicky would go on to appear in the hit British TV show Allo Allo in the 1980s. And now the hot-blooded Irishmen would have to compete with the hot-blooded British men for her attention. However, besides Sally, there is a cultural note in the theme of the ad, as it seems to be set in the Middle East. At this time, there was a new trend for Irish people to travel to the Middle East to places like Saudi Arabia. Here, they would work on lucrative contracts and live in closed Western compounds. These were the new Irish where once we sent bartenders to Boston and bricklayers to London, now the skills of highly educated professionals from medicine, engineering and education were travelling out to these countries. In the 1990s, harp sales began to decline. It was threatened by new beers such as the German Furstenberg as the new must-have beer. Some connoisseurs reckoned harp tasted like, quote, battery acid. And even then, the Irish folk singer Christy Moore called harp Harpic in one of his songs. Harpic is a domestic bleach, by the way. But today harp is still very popular in Northern Ireland and Donegal. So the advert is remembered with a degree of fondness by the Irish. Correction, more irreverent fondness. And I was on YouTube and picked up these comments from copies of the ad that you've just seen. And by the way, apologies for some of the language you're about to hear. Connor. Love how he's writing home to his family, saying that he's just misses the harp and doesn't give a dog's bollocks about them. Seamus, what an ad. Pure understated class. Sadly, that particular lager tasted like piss, but hey-ho. John Joe, I'd say your man pulled himself asunder, thinking of the look Sally O'Brien might give him. Ah, I'm not going to explain that one. I was unable to find out who the male actor is, but one YouTube wit commented, quote, Plot twist. He's in a Saudi prison cell due to the fact that he attempted to smuggle a pint of harp into a dry country. So if you are in a faraway country and you want to test the credentials of your local Irish pub, 
Go in and ask them. I dare you. About Sally O'Brien. And the way she might look at you. Thank you for watching. But please like and subscribe. As this will encourage future productions.